Hi, I'm Melissa Jane from Vibe FM and I'm down here in Marbella joined by Tom, Antonio, Lee and Brandon who are Access All Areas. So we're going to go one by one. So tell me a bit about yourself, Tom. I hear you're the joker of the band. Uh, that's what they say. They say I'm the joker of the band, but um, I don't really see it that way. It's just, definitely funny. I just don't really like serious situations. <laughs> um, so yeah, I suppose in that sense, I never take anything seriously. As we say many, many times, Bo uh, Tom has this gland right here that kind of makes you think, you know, you shouldn't be saying that, but he actually does say it. It's that gland, burnt. <laughs> he says it. So Antonio, so I hear you're from Venezuela. Sí. So vamos a hacer parte de la entrevista en español, ¿está bien? Sí, está bien. Okay, so you are definitely no stranger to the music or television scene, so tell me a bit about yourself. Well, I've been doing music since I was nine and stuff, and I've been in bands in Venezuela since nine, ten, and in Mexico when I was 14. So it's been a pretty interesting musical life, you could say. So. Well, and I've also seen your TV series when you were younger as well. Yeah, it's a cringe when I, when I see it. <laughs> 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 they make fun of me all the time because they just look like a, well, baby. <laughs> You've been more successful than all of us put together. So <laughs> <laughs> and Lee, you're also no stranger to the music scene. What have you been up to? Yeah, I've been singing from basically a really young age. I've been fortunate to sing around the world. And um, I basically, me and Antonio's been singing now for quite, what, four years? Yeah, man. So, you know, we're getting all good. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and Brandon, you're the youngest member of the group, is that right? That's right, I'm the baby. Oh, so you don't you don't get teased or anything now? Um, of course he does. <laughs> lad. It comes with the territory. <laughs> <laughs> it comes with the territory. Yeah, I'm the baby. A good sport, though. You've got to be. You've got to be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's all good. Cool. So, do you make a thing in Marbella? Come on, what do you do here in Marbella? Ah, bueno, estamos ahorita quedándonos prácticamente en la casa de Tom y pues este. Estamos practicando las canciones nuevas, escribiendo muchas canciones, eh, practicando las rutinas, el baile y todo, y también practicando instrumentos y todo, porque vamos a ir de regreso al Reino Unido a grabar un single nuevo, posiblemente. Y pues nada, preparándonos y disfrutando el, el clima. Well, you've definitely come at the right time. It's absolutely roasting out here on the terrace. Oh, it's great. <laughs> so tell me a bit about the group itself. Uh, the group, the group. Well, the group was started uh, a long time ago with Lee, uh, me, and then me, me. along came this Hispanic angel. <laughs> <laughs> um, and then they yeah. find me. I was uh, busking on the street with a quart of whiskey and and you know well. long hair. I was about forty at the time. <laughs> <laughs> they, <laughs> they shaved me. Said I looked about twenty three. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, and yeah, and then. Brandon here. When I, was, I was found in a performing arts college by Antonio over here. We were performing, uh, well, doing musical theater stuff for about two years together. And uh, he pulled me into the band after we'd finished and got all our grades and stuff. I, I assessed him for two years, basically. For two years, I was like, maybe. But, you know, I until I saw him actually singing and playing, then, you know. So you're kind of like his mentor for a little while. I, I, I was <laughs> a little bit. Don't get bit, a, bit, bit <laughs> like a, a Latino Simon Cowell, maybe. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I like well that. You've, I know you've been very busy for the past year in Orlando. What have you guys been up to over there? Well, basically in Orlando, uh, what we've been doing is rehearsing a lot. Uh, we've had a, actually a couple of offers to do a TV show. Uh, Pop Star Studio. One of them. Yeah, pop star studios. Uh, where we'd come in and we'd work in the studio and they'd kind of film us and what we get up to, like recording our songs. And basically, we did a lot of songwriting over there as well. Um, Gary Williams. We've been with, yeah. working with um, a vocal coach called Gary Williams, who's worked with Beyonce and he did um, the whole training with NSYNC and Backstreet Boys and things. He's amazing. We really also, really I think we also chose Orlando as a, as a base because it's kind of like. Pop central, isn't it? Like yeah. we chose it as a base because there's <laughs> Disneyland. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but yeah, that too. Uh, so um, I hear you've, you've been um, appr uh, approached even, but for a new TV music show. Tell me a bit about that. It starts filming in April, right? Uh, yeah, that's um, that's based in Orlando. It's based around a studio called KDS Studios. Uh, it's a phenomenal, amazing location, uh, and we were lucky enough to rehearse in there uh, the last time we were there, and um, you know. They just offered, they said, would you like to be in this? We're making this TV show. Would you like to be in it? And we didn't say no. <laughs> <laughs> Jumped at the chance. So, bueno, aparte de, de la serie, eh, ¿qué vais a hacer este año? 
Este año tenemos muchos proyectos, eh, claro, grabar más canciones y escribir más canciones, el, la televisión y todo. Eh, también estamos en, hablando de hacer ta, posiblemente eh, un programa de televisión en español para los uh, latinoamericanos, este, un programa que puede ser visto mucho en México y todo, eh, una miniserie, tal vez. Y pues seguir practicando, seguir cosechando éxitos posiblemente. Qué bien. So, what are your plans for the rest of the year as a group? Well, we're going to continue working on original songs, going to continue to practice, and we're uh, hoping to basically just get out there and uh, show people what we got. 2011, and this is the year of accessible areas. And going to Disney World again. <laughs> <laughs> cool. Maybe so Universal yeah. Studios, yeah. maybe Disneyland Paris, something maybe, there before. Yeah, some, <laughs> I fancy something different. Go to California to get to Disneyland there. <laughs> So are you going to play us a little acapella tune to give us, you know, a little taster of your music? Yeah, we can do. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, let's hit it. Let's do it. Yeah, yeah let's do this. We never in the black marks from last night Our from teacher cried Still on my spare shoes I slept over the three that you wrote last night I picked up the clothes that you drew outside Not a day we could leave it behind I guess we get a little bit crazy I guess we get a little bit cruel This is how crazy you make me Bad enough to think about losing you But even as I walk away And I say I'm gonna stay Only takes a moment or two Cause you and I both know the truth I'm crazy for you I'm crazy for you Thanks very much for joining us. Thank and you, thank we'll you. definitely catch up with you later on in the year. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Thank you.